Two men have been arrested in connection with a deadly shooting spree that killed four people. The shootings all happened within a five-mile radius and within just three hours of each other. Detectives say the men they arrested are both gang members. But why? Why were the victims targeted? NBC4's Macy Jenkins live right now in downtown L.A. outside the Hall of Justice. Macy? Hi, Colleen. Well, L.A. County Sheriff's Department worked along with multiple agencies to make those arrests, those two arrests you mentioned. Within 48 hours of all of these murders, the common denominator, an SUV that was spotted near the scene of all of the crimes. A string of murders in the middle of the night, chilling for neighbors in southeast L.A. County. Multiple times in one night. How, do, how does that happen? Four killed in four different neighborhoods, all within a five-mile radius. And police say the victims were all random. The first in the small city of Bell. He was fun. He liked playing. And I just, I'm not, I can't talk anymore. A mother devastated by the loss of her 24-year-old son, Kevin Parada, shot to death 1130 Sunday night on Bear Avenue just outside of Marta Escutia Primary Center. I didn't believe it at all. I didn't, I, I tried to convince myself it wasn't him. His childhood friend, Damon Dowell, knew him fondly by the nickname Kanakas. He was a father, left behind a, a beautiful child, son, but um, we'll be there for him. We'll try to, our best to, to let his, his son know that his father was a very, very loving and happy person. The second shooting. Ah, and then like, I just, I don't know. I don't know how I didn't get hit. The link between all four, according to investigators, this Honda Pilot SUV spotted at each location near the time of each shooting. Because of this just really good police work, um, we can assure our Southeast Los Angeles community that there is no active threat to their neighborhoods. Police arrested 42-year-old Gary Garcia and 20-year-old Wayne McNeely Timberland and say they plan to arrest one more. They say the shootings were gang-related, but the victims, again, were all chosen at random. I'm grateful that they caught the killers. I'm grateful that they caught my baby's killers. It's one more that they're going to get. The two men in custody were both arrested on conspiracy to commit murder, suspicion of murder, and attempted murder charges. They are The bail is set at $2 million, and they are both set to face a judge for an arraignment later this week. Reporting live in downtown Los Angeles, Macy Jenkins, NBC4 News.